I forgot how to do this, honestly. It's been so long. Yeah, that's good. Should I sit in a chair, maybe? Bruh, I don't know how to do this anymore. Welcome. Or should I say welcome back? Okay, I love these shorts, but you guys aren't even gonna see them, so I'm switching to sweatpants. Much better. This whole outfit is from Cotton On, by the way, and it's so comfy. The shorts are also from Cotton On. I went into the store for 10 minutes and I blacked out and bought everything in sight, but totally worth it. This is organic. It's super comfy and soft. 10 out of 10 recommend. Okay, hi, <laughs> how are you? It has been a month since we posted our last vlog and that is quite some time. I'm sorry, it has just been uh, kind of crazy. <laughs> kind of crazy, I'm kind of crazy. And by the way, let's ignore my bangs. I don't know what they're doing. This is the first time I curl my hair since I got my hair done, which is probably the first thing I'm gonna talk about. I got my hair done. My hair was dark brown. Well, it was red and then I went back to dark brown twice and then I did this. So I am honestly just as surprised as you are that my hair got this light in the first session. I know last time I said that I was gonna keep my hair dark brown, like my natural color, but honestly guys, I just changed my mind way too many times. I am going lighter. I will go lighter and stay light. That's the plan. I just asked for balayage. I just showed her a picture of a girl that was pretty much all blonde except for the dark root. So like I said, this is the first session. I'm gonna go and get toned in a month or two and then we'll probably do another session in like six months just so it's not super bad on my hair. I'm so surprised I did not have any breakage or damage from the bleach. Obviously, if you're putting bleach in your hair, there's gonna be some sort of damage, but she said I had zero breakage and it still feels really soft and healthy. So. I'm really happy about it. I feel like it really fits me, especially with the tan. So I'm loving it. I'm living my best life with this hair. And when my bangs grow out, I'm gonna try to do some money pieces and then basically just a lot lighter of a blonde. By the way, I'm drinking a Topo Chico. I love drinking these with a, like a whole lemon just squirted inside. And then I'll do a little lemon on the rim and tahini on the rim. It's so freaking good. Okay, so. I feel like I have so much to say and I don't even know where to start and I don't want this video to be all over the place but I kind of wanted to just sit down bestie to bestie and just talk to you guys because it's been a minute since I've sat down and kind of gave a little life update on what's been going on. I stay posting on my Instagram stories if you're not following it's at it's Amanda Pena. I had another Instagram at around 70k and they completely deleted it and they would not give it back so if you want to follow my new Instagram I am always on there and then I'm also super consistent with TikTok videos. So that username is also at it's Amanda Pena. And that's honestly the reason why we haven't been consistent on YouTube is because we're so consistent on the other platforms. But at the end of the day, YouTube is where we started. I don't think we'll ever quit. I love YouTube. It's just harder to sit down and film a whole family vlog versus doing a quick 15 to 60 second TikTok video. But let me tell you guys what we've been doing. So ever since we sold our house, Chris and I have become investors and house flippers. It is crazy to say because this has honestly been a dream for us. We've always wanted to do this. We've always been around real estate. My whole family's in real estate and we were just waiting for the perfect opportunity to start this journey and the time is finally here. So I am so excited because I'm gonna show you guys some of the footage of our first flip we bought this beautiful mountain home but she needed a lot of love so we hired our team to go in and demo the whole place rip everything out and kind of start fresh i am so excited you guys know i am a huge creative obviously i'm sitting here in front of a camera talking to myself with social media and creating content i get to express my creativity and i love it so much and with flipping houses i also get to do that but in a different way so it has just been so fun I mean from choosing floors to the wall color inside and out figuring out how the whole kitchen is gonna look the bathrooms the styling there's just so much that goes into it and I have been loving it Chris has been amazing you guys I think he truly has found his passion I have just been admiring him and I'm so freaking proud of him if you've been with us from the beginning you know that Chris has been trying so many things he joined the military when he was 18 straight out of high school and he was in the army for almost four years but after that he didn't really know what he wanted to do with his life he was helping me with this channel and we were vlogging as a family but this has always kind of been my thing 
So he worked at USPS, he was a real estate agent, he worked in property management, he worked in the loan side of things, he signed up for nursing school, he has done so many different things, but you guys, I feel like this is it for him. And that's the thing when you're self-employed, you can have 10 different job titles because for me, for example, I just say I'm a content creator, but that equals so many different things. One day I'm working with a brand and then the next day I am working on stuff for my own personal brand or I'm doing photography as a side hustle, which I just started. We haven't even talked about that, but that has been so fun for me. My point is when you're self-employed, things are always changing. Every day could be something different. So for Chris, he was, you know, always doing the nine to five thing and then he became self-employed. These past six years that we've been married, we have tried a lot of things, but I can honestly say I feel like we have got it somewhat under control now to where we know what we're doing when we wake up. We know what we're doing for the day and it just feels really good to have that type of security and financial freedom thank god like this would not have been possible without god and you guys you guys are the reason i'm still creating content and you were a huge part in us moving into our first home and then the sale of that first home allowed us to become investors and it's just and become financially free, which, ah, I could cry about that, but I'm on my period, by the way, so maybe that's why I'm getting so emotional, but I'm just so grateful to have you guys as our supporters, our besties, and it has just been a crazy, crazy life these past six years, being married, having two kids. Speaking of the kids, they are getting so big. Stella is three and Ava is four, but she will be five in six days. Ah! How is it possible that we're gonna have a five-year-old? what and she's starting school you guys like what she's actually starting school in like 10 weeks or something i just i can't the kids are growing up our cats are growing up they are just little angels they literally just sleep all day they cuddle us they never hiss they never scratch at anyone they never hiss at anyone god knew we needed them this is bubba if you've never met bubba she is getting so big. She's literally a full grown cat now. Bubba is a Russian blue. She is so beautiful. I love her shiny coat and Bear is knocked out in our room. And yeah, they are getting so big. We love them so much. Chris loves them. You guys, we were not cat people for the longest time just because I thought cats were mean, I'm not gonna lie. But like I said, these cats are angels. They are so well behaved and we kind of spoil them. We get them the best litter, the best food. <laughs> they are living their best life here. Chris got me these beautiful flowers on Mother's Day and I didn't know that Lily's were toxic for cats they weren't licking them or smelling them or anything but you guys dm'd me on instagram to warn me and i thank you guys so much because i was able to put the flowers in the room and close the door so that when we left they wouldn't touch them or anything because i didn't realize how toxic and dangerous lilies are for cats although cats are pretty easy to take care of especially if they're indoor cats you don't really have to worry about them going outside and what they're getting into we are still learning a lot about being pet parents i actually came across a telehealth service for pet parents and it's really cool so I wanted to share it with you guys. It's called Fuzzy and they were sweet enough to offer you guys a seven day free trial. If you're like me and you spend hours Googling something, for example, how to take care of your pet, everything from why is my cat sneezing so much to what do I do if my dog eats a stick of butter. Skip crowdsourcing recommendations from social media, forums, or trial and error and get answers immediately with Fuzzy. So Fuzzy is a telehealth service for pet parents that offers 24 seven access to personalized pet care from veterinary professionals. From everyday questions to middle of the night emergencies, Fuzzy has the answers that pet parents need. Through live chat and virtual vet consultations available to you 24 hours a day, seven days a week, Fuzzy can answer your pet questions big and small, urgent and everyday. Fuzzy can also recommend the exact right products for your pet, which are handpicked by their established team of veterinary professionals. And these are available at discounts exclusive to Fuzzy members. So from getting your pet's diet just right to meeting their middle of the night needs to finally figuring out what makes their breath smell that way. Nothing is too big or small for a quick fuzzy call. Right now, Fuzzy is offering my subscribers a free seven day trial membership. Go to yourfuzzy.com slash pennyfam today to sign up. That's a free seven day trial and access to exclusive member discounts on pet meds, supplements, food, and more at y-o-u-r-f-u-z-z-y.com slash pennyfam. Again, yourfuzzy.com slash pennyfam. 
for your free trial of Fuzzy with access to 24-7 personalized pet care and vet recommended products. Wait, I just heard the garage door open. I'm not even kidding. Chris just got home. So I'm gonna pretend that I'm sleeping and let's see if he believes it. <laughs> I never take naps, so he's definitely not gonna believe it. Why is he taking forever? I swear I looked at this and I didn't see the button recording. You thought I was just doing this for fun? Yeah, I thought you were just trying to be funny. Oh, we all I don't have to try, baby. I just ain't. <laughs> Where were you? Your mama's house. Come here real quick. What's you need up? to give them, I already gave them a life update of what's been going on. But you need to, they need to hear from you. Okay, where were you? Uh, we were at our house. What house? The house that we bought. For what? To uh, make money. This is a man's uh, description. I just talked for like 30 minutes about it and you're like, come make money? We bought a house to flip. Yes, I told them. We're almost done, you guys. I didn't even say that, but we're almost done with the We're about thing. halfway, halfway done. We're at the final We're stretch. at the halfway mark. <laughs> the halfway okay, mark. don't say that. Yeah, it's crazy. I mean, like um, the major stuff is, is getting finished this week and next week. And then after that, it's just like a... You know, vanities, light fixtures, toilets, the finishing touches, yeah. That's to make the, it look all nice and pretty. Yeah, that's the fun stuff. I can't but. wait till me and my mom go in with all the plants. <laughs> He's like so excited. That's gonna make it feel so alive. Oh my gosh, I can't wait. That's anyway. why we need the plants for good energy, because this uh, boy is in there. No, I mean, other than that, I mean, life is crazy. Mm -hmm. I mean, we usually get on here, what, every eight months, and then give them an update, and then come back I posted another a eight months. A month ago. Not bad. Hmm. Not as bad as you thought, huh? Yeah, not as bad. As the Malibu one, I think. No, it's cool, you know? I mean, we uh, sold our house, and we decided that we wanted to make some money off of investments, and so we're making it happen. It's cool because we've been talking about doing this stuff for a long time, years. You know, when we have the money, we're gonna do this. When we have the money, we're gonna do this. So thankfully, yeah. we got that money, and I promise you, within two weeks, like literally, you guys, we we're did making not it waste happen. Time. Like we had the blueprint, so now we're just executing all of our uh, all of our moves. And yeah, a lot of people when they get money, they either spend it or it just sits there. And we were like, no, as soon as we have the opportunity, not only to be financially free, but to have like a good chunk of money, we are going to invest. We're it. financially free. Yes. Thank the Lord, yes. because that was like a major Amen. thing in our life that was hindering us, I feel. Yeah, it was, money is always like a thing, you know, whether it's a good or bad thing. Whether you want to believe it yeah, or not. Like if sucks, you're in a position to where you're stressed out a lot because of finances, then it, unfortunately it's going to pour over pour over into other aspects of your life. and. Yeah. Um, we were to a point where we were just over it. So we took control of it, took advantage of, of the opportunity, and yeah. here we are. And we know we're not the only ones. Like, there's, there were so many people. There's, there still are people, you know. I'm not going to say that. I was going to say, like, struggling. And people are struggling, and I think you should leave that in just to show that, like, we're sensitive to that. Like, we don't look down upon anyone. We don't look up to anyone other than God, and I think that's important. I mean, money is not going to change us. We're going to obviously... Um, make a lot of money and we're going to be very financial financially wealthy um, but I mean we're doing it the right way and and I think that you know it just comes with blessing that that comes with blessing people I mean we were blessed to have this opportunity and we're going to be we're going to be in a position to bless a lot of people around us too and that's what the biggest thing that we're focused on right now is and that's why I think that we're going to be successful sorry I don't think I know we're going to be successful we're already taking the steps you know so it's, Her, period it's crazy. yeah that's true that's the whole point it's yeah. like why have money if you're if you can't bless people with it yeah no we're not selfish people I mean no I think they it's know crazy. that they've been watching us for six years now. 
Yeah, it's crazy though because you guys on the other side of this probably always thought that we were, you know, rich. And I mean, in a way, technically we were because we're blessed for sure. I mean, we were Not able to buy our own house, yeah. but like for a long time there, we were very uh, tight. Very, very, paycheck very, paycheck, very, paycheck, literally. Very tight. Paycheck to paycheck. Nah, and not even. Pay, pay, paycheck to catch up and then yeah. go below. Oh, no, not even. Paycheck. In debt. We were in debt. Hi, my So baby. much money. <laughs> I miss you. Okay, go back. I have to get you guys ready so we can vlog. Mommy's going to get ready. Daddy's going to go get the car washed. Let me tell you something. What's up, my love? Stella, Stella, Are you snitching? No, Stella was taking my side and she was wiping her tongue and... On my lip and tongue on my lip and tongue on my What do you lip. want me to do about then, it, my love? And then she and then she took my spot and then she she said, It's my spot, it's my spot. Okay. And then That's a reality. What do you guys. Want, what do you want me to do about it? <laughs> Come here, Stella. <laughs> See you guys. I was gonna get them ready all cute. Come here, Stella. That was gonna be like the first vlog coming back, but this is a reality. I need to do laundry. I don't have any matching clothes for them so i'm about to go do some laundry ava said you're being mean should i smack your butt she told me i should smack your butt no. she's in a christmas dress are you listening are you being mean are you sure you need to stop you understand because i know i know you're not telling the truth do you understand can you guys say hi to the penny fam hi penny fam okay i'm gonna go clean the car okay we're Did you tell them where we're going tonight? No. We're going to the Angel Game. Okay, bye. My fam. Even though we're Giants fans in this house. True. All right, baby. You. Yep. Hi guys. It's already 12 p.m. and I, I need to do so many things. Guys, I have this iPad. Yes, so the iPad. She loves the iPad. Yeah, and I have a poppy game. Ooh. In your fam, my mommy said we can vlog today, so we're vlogging. Period. And I'm wearing my swimsuit. I, I have, sleeped in it. I, I have, slept in I it. Have I have slept in it. Yes. And, and I, I scared my mom when I woke up. She scared I, the crap out of me this morning. <laughs> I have I have this game. Mm -hmm. So I can okay. play it on the couch. Okay. Big lens. What? Big lens. Big lens. This is not mommy's big lens. You guys want to see my big lens for photography? Let me go get it. Yep, she has big lens. And this is my sister. Say hi, Stella. Hi. So, this is a big lens. Yep. And this isn't even the whole thing. There's another attachment that goes. Uh, Try the big lens. I can't put it on this camera. So, we are vlogging with our vlogging camera. Marla. This is for the photography camera. I have all my yeah, I need to do laundry. Like I said, I need to clean the house before we go because. One thing about me is I feel stressed when the house is not clean and I want to come home to a clean house. I'm going to get my toy for Christmas. Okay, just kind of do a deep clean, this, you know? This is my sad picture. Oh my goodness. <laughs> Why are you taking sad pic? Stop. <laughs> what else do you have on this thing? Stop. No, no, wait, 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 what? <laughs> You're vlogging on here? Dada, look at this. <laughs> Comment down below if we should go through Ava's iPad for a video and post all of the stuff that's in here. <laughs> Stella was bugging me there. <gasps> Excuse me, Penny fam, what is this? <laughs> no, look at, look, look, look. Let me show you something. You guys. Let me show you She's getting sold. You both are getting sold. And how old are you? Two. Two. You're not two. You're three. You know you're three. Hi, girlies. Hi. Hi. Special, Hi. Hi. Where are you going now? Special, special. Where are you going? Special. Where are you going? It's cute. Oh. Nobody likes giving me vessels around here. You Where see are this? you going, Daddy? I'm going to go get the car washed. Bye, I love you. Please, the blood of Jesus of you. My okay, guys, we're gonna have to save that for another video because this when video I, is way too long already. When I press this button, guys, then, then, oh my gosh, oh, she spilled the whole bottle. <laughs> it's okay, it's water. But that is gonna be it for today's video. I hope you guys. <laughs>
we're gonna vlog. We have to go eat. I am starving. Daddy's waiting for us outside. That's gonna be it for this video. I promise we'll vlog more. Comment down below if you want no, us to, no, no, to see no, more no. vlogs. No. Go. We're, they're, gonna, they're, gonna, <laughs> they're gonna see us. They're gonna see us on Instagram. They're gonna see us on TikTok. Go follow us on Instagram and TikTok. Love you guys. No. We'll see you next time. Besito. Besito. Love you guys.